Hey, what's up, you guys? This is Brandon, one of the trainers at Moffat Towers 2. Today, what I want to talk about is first how to do a proper bicep curl. And two, I want to break down a little bit of the anatomy uh, that makes up the bicep. And also, two different variations that can help you in your workout to target different areas of the bicep, okay? So, inside of your bicep, real quick, this is just what they call the short head of the bicep. Outside is the long head of the bicep. To do a proper bicep curl, I see a lot of this. <laughs> a lot of, a lot of using back muscles, using hips, legs, everything. We're working everything except what we're trying to target is the bicep muscle, okay? So for once, you gotta be under control, okay? You gotta keep the elbows back, shoulders roll back. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna curl up, squeeze. So you notice I'm not all the way up to the shoulders. I'm right here. You should be right at peak right here where your arm is kind of like in an L shape. Then from here, the rep's not over. Slowly come down, control all the way back to the bottom. Squeeze all the way back to the bottom, okay? Anytime you're lifting weights, got to control, okay? If you're swinging, momentum, you're not getting the tension and you're not targeting the area of the bicep, what you're trying to work out in this exercise, okay? Real quick, two quick variations that could uh, target different areas of the bicep. So, let's start off with the long head, the outside. The more narrow that you're inside, the more you're going to target that, that long head of the bicep. So, hammer curls. I love doing these. So, what you're going to do is, instead of being outside, you want to bring them in just a little slightly inside shoulder width. Then from here, you're going to curl up, squeeze. You see, you notice I'm in that L shape. I'm flexing at the top. At peak, slowly come back down. Squeeze and come back down. So like I said, hammer curls are a great, a great way to target that long head of the bicep, the outside. So now we want to target the short head. The inside, instead of going narrow, you go a little bit wide. So what you're going to do here is go slightly outside shoulder width, okay? Same thing, shoulders back, keep the elbows back. You're going to curl up, squeeze, still in that L shape. I'm not done with the rep. Slowly come back down. Stay in control. Keep that tension. Squeeze back up. Nice control. All right. So hopefully that guys will that will help you out with your future workouts. Like I said, to get a complete bicep, you want to make sure you're doing different variations so that you get the full potential of what you're trying to do and trying to build a perfect bicep. Okay. Hopefully that helps you out, you guys. Take care.